What an absolute failure Marvel has become. If this doesn't show you the absolute decline of Marvel, then I don't know what will because this is absolutely insane news. We know that Marvel for a very long time has continued to embrace the identity politics with everything that they are creating and they have tried to get this Blade movie off the ground for years and years and years now at this point. It should be a pretty simple thing for Marvel to do. It has everything that they want. It has a black lead. It has all of the things, right? All of the bells and whistles that Marvel is looking for but they can't make it happen. And part of that is because they are still trying to wokeify Blade, even though it already has a black lead in it. They tried to make a script for Blade that had a, a, a like a female lead cast in it, and Blade was going to be like a secondary sidekick character in his own movie. This whole thing is absolutely insane. It shows just how off the deep end Marvel has gotten, and now we have uh, none other than the legend himself, Wesley Snipes today, who is taking hilarious shots shots at woke Marvel because of the fact that they are falling apart. So let's get into all the insanity here. We also got this news that just came out recently, just a couple days ago actually. Actually, I think it was just uh, yesterday, I think, where uh, Mahershala Ali's lawyer was roasting Marvel as well. So Blade will happen someday, says Mahershala Ali's lawyer. Craziest thing. So Mahershala Ali is supposed to be playing the new Blade for the Blade franchise coming from Marvel. Recently saw the news that Blade lost its second director and is on at least its seventh writer. That is absolutely pathetic. Maybe if they would stop going after DEI writers and stuff, then they would actually get a good script, but Marvel is not interested in that, are they? Now, the lawyer of Mahershala Ali, Shelby Weiser, one of the top lawyers in Hollywood, offers her two cents and can't believe the movie hasn't happened yet, as Marvel announced it way back in 2019. It's been almost five years since they announced they were going to be making a Blade movie. Speaking with The Hollywood Reporter, the article confirms Mahershala Ali has signed on for the Jurassic World reboot. It says Ali is also top-lining Marvel's Blade someday whenever that happens. The article then includes a quote from Weiser. The deal was in 2019 and they still haven't shot it, which is pretty much the craziest thing in my professional experience, especially coming from Marvel. Like, this should have been an easy dub for Marvel, but they can't make it happen. And uh, Blade seems to be in development hell as again. Just two days ago, saw the news that director Jan uh, Damanji has exited the movie. The second director to do so, following ba Basim uh, Tariq, a new third director is yet to be named. It's also confirmed another new writer is on board, once again, which is not really much of a shock. But today we have none other than the man himself, Wesley Snipes, who of course played the legendary role of Blade back in the first Blade movie that that came out, which was absolutely incredible, and this is what he had to say, okay? This is fantastic stuff coming from Wesley Snipes. Blade, lordy, lordy, lordy. Folks still looking for the secret sauce. Riding snowmobiles in traffic, kind of rough. Daywalkers make it look easy, don't they? So this is absolutely fantastic to see Wesley Snipes, the legend himself, taking shot at woke Marvel. This is absolutely fantastic. This shows you just how pathetic Marvel has gotten. It's absolutely insane. But let me know what you think about all this in the comments below. Let me know what you think about what Wesley Snipes says here. Hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a like, subscribe, and I'll talk to you all in another video very soon.